Well, hello everyone, are you ready for another adventure? It's me, Wookie, and I'm here with Psychonauts! Woo! There's a new game coming in the month. It's finally the way for Psychonauts 2, which I feel like I've been waiting since the ending of the original Psychonauts when it first released. So I just wanted to play some Psychonauts, because this is one of my favorite games. I'm a big fan of the Tim Schafer style of games. Not afraid to mention it. I think he's a very cool dude, and I'm looking forward to more of what Double Fine can do in, uh... Too. But for now, let's get playing. I did a little bit of the beginning because I remember in the beginning it can be a little bit long. So we can actually get into the first level. If you've never played Psychonauts, by the way, if you end up liking this video, leave a like, comment, subscribe. <laughs> Forgot. Uh, this game is great. Press Y to talk. So yeah, this is a game about going into people's minds. Coach Oleander, I'm reporting for basic braining. Son! You realize that to take my course, I will have to pull you into my mind. You will have to relive every bullet-scarred memory of every battle I have ever faced. It won't be pretty. Are you sure you wouldn't rather run around a bit more in the sunshine first? Maybe I will explore a bit more before, just so I'm prepared. I'm ready, ready, sir. Well then... Yeah, and here's the PS2 style graphics. Give me 20. <laughs> Though originally released, I think, on Xbox and then later ported to PS2. Never made it to GameCube. Damn shame. So I had to come back, to, I had to show up to this game many years later. Yeah, so this is an HD 5 so, version of it. This is it. I wish I were a man. <laughs> Like a dentist office. A mental dentist office. It's a recruiting office, kids. And I'm here to recruit you for the greatest job in the world. Being a psychonaut. It's about fighting a war for mental freedom. Are you ready to face torture, insanity, and death? Because this is your last chance to chicken out. Oh, me, sir. I'd like to chicken out, please. Too late, soldier. But you said... There's only one way out of here. Fighting! I want one of you chickens to sock me square in a jaw. I warn you, once you do, the war is on. I said punch punch. me! I want you. I'm kind of looking around real quick. Do it! Ah, that's what I'm talking about. Ah! <laughs> what kind okay. of obstacle course is this? That kid just got killed. A mental obstacle course, you bleeding heart. He's not dead. His astral projection just got kicked out of my mind. And I'll kick your astral projection out of here too if you don't get moving right now. Alright, so I've got enough instructions. Oh, wait, that's health. Alright, I absorb some positive mental health. Cool. Always looking forward to that. Always need more of it. Who doesn't, though? I guess people with good support systems, I, I think. I think in general everyone does. See, I'm gonna be really interested to see. I think they've made the right sayings of this game was released at a very specific time! Okay, good. I thought I was going to die. Was made at a very specific time, so some of the mental health things can be a little bit uh, disarming for many people. But I think even with all that stuff said, I still think that they have some pretty good stuff to say about That's mental health, especially for a game released in what I think is 2005. Right through, Definitely more than some other ones. Right up, right up, it's good that they're like putting powers. that into mind for Psychonauts 2. I can kind of forgive older stuff, but, up, you know... Older. More modern times. If you want to do the cool concept, you better uh, put your full things into it. That's my emotional baggage. At? We all have emotional baggage, kid. Why don't you make yourself useful? Sort some of it out while you're in here. Keep your eyes peeled for a tag that matches. Could be anywhere. But yeah, I always liked how everything was themed to the, the person's mental state, so this one has a lot of, like, tanks and is. war stuff. Now, you will pick a 
that tag and you will put it on that bag you just found. Unless you'd rather just drop and get me 20 right now! It's fine. Oh god. <laughs> oh, he's so happy. Sorted out emotional baggage. Steamer trunk tag. You're like molasses. You hit that ladder hard, son. Show it who's boss. <laughs> oh god, I just love this game so much. I don't even have to make many jokes because this game makes all the jokes for me, and I can just laugh at them. National bugging. Some of that, so you can see here, yeah, some war stuff. Right here, get that. I think there's one. I don't see it. What did it say? Mount the pole to climb. Got it. Oh god. There we go. Climb! Oh, I see what he meant, with fire down below. I thought it was just a, a phrase he was saying. I yeah, remember this kid's kind of an asshole. We can't get past this. This is stupid. Hmm. Looks like a test. There's probably a secret, more advanced route. What's that supposed to mean? You think you're more advanced than me, new kid? This Sorry. kid's what? afro has always bothered me. You're stupid. The coach is stupid. The whole camp is stupid. That thing flying at you is stupid. What's flying at me? Whoa. <laughs> Bobby Zilch's his foot. That's what. You stupid new kid. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Thanks for saving me. Well, actually, I was saving this plant. Huh. Never seen one so meaty before. I have. It's been appearing in this creepy nightmare I keep having. You're having nightmares? Oh, I've been reading about how to fix those. Will you let me see one? Hmm. No. Move, move, move! I actually do need to get down here, though. I got some stuff. Come on, one nightmare. Nope. <laughs> Come on, one nightmare. Nope. The lady protests too much. Oh shit. I meant to do that. Yeah, let's see. Can't remember if there's more stuff it's to find over here. Day, kid. So I'm gonna go back. Because I want to make sure I got everything that I could. So you got that. Yeah, I kind of want to see what's on over there, so I'm actually going to go over here. Dang, my bowels move more than you do, Pokey! Oh god. Did not see... Did not see that at all. It's too brown. The only time you'll ever hear me complain about something too brown. There we go. It's actually not true. I complain a lot about the brownness in uh, 360 games because it's not very colorful. Man, that era. Not great in terms of if you like color palette. If you'd love to count the color palette, then the 360 era was bad for you, and yeah, that includes PS3 games, because holy shit, the PS3 was a garbage console. It still is a garbage console. I think it might actually go down as one of the worst as time goes by. Some good games, for sure, but the Nintendo 64 also had good games. It does not stop it from being a garbage what? console. More motivating. I'm going! Fuck! Oh, shit. See, I kind of want to go back now, because I want all the image stuff. I think they're called mirages. Okay. 
So I am actually gonna have to go both ways. Remember when I first played this, I did the same thing. Okay. I'm just gonna collect them and then go back. One. Not really. A, how did I miss that? My death perception is terrible. Onward and upward, soldier. God damn it! <laughs> how did I miss it again? Come on. Come on. There we go. All right. There we go. Now we can move on. Alright, let's see. Go up here. Go up here. Go up here. Oh, I can use that or... I'm, I'm just saying, I'm gonna pl I've been playing on the Xbox 360 Jimmy. version. I think the Steam no, version is still fucked. I'm call you Slowy Joey. That's not my name. What was that, Slowy? I can't hear ya, you're talking too slow. <laughs> Uh, I think the Steam version is still fucked. I had to use some weird, like, Steam uh, controller keys to make it work. It's pretty You'll have plenty of time to stand around when you're dead. There's emotional baggage. I need to find the tag, though. Oh, I had the tag already. I'm dumb. Me. So happy, man. That's how my emotional baggage hopefully gets sorted out. It's just that easy. It's not. But, you know, it's a video game. Alright, let's go. Get some stuff here, get some stuff here. Thank you. Whoop. Oh, there's some stuff I'm missing. Get back here. Oh. Is that gonna play me game? You'll have plenty of time to stand around when you're dead. I am dead if I don't get all these damn things. Got it! It's one down, and only one more to go. Okay, let's see, where'd it go? Where did it go? Somewhere up here? Yes. Got it. Okay, we can move on. Mentalis Uberalis! <laughs> One thing I do remember about this uh, level is that this guy's uh, Coach Eliander's fucking barking gets really old. Down, sideways, whatever way you want. Just get on it. Quick, like a monkey. Monkey? Oh god. Hey, slow down, kid. It's a pass me. Hey, my bowels move more than you do, Pokey! Yeah. Uh, can you hear me? Where are you? Don't be the one else to talk to. I trained! I trained! Oh god. It's okay. He died. He was kind of a dick. Watch those mines, kid. They'll blow you up like a ten cent kazoo. Hey, Dogen, what's wrong? They keep blowing up. You're like molasses, go. Follow me. I'll help you through the mines. Okay. okay. Come on, Dogen. We can do this, buddy. I can't do it. I can't do it. No! There is a way to get him across, I'm pretty You're sure. Like molasses going up hill in January. So to... With crutches. Then just follow me. Okay. Hey, Dogen. You can do it, buddy. You can do it. I believe in you. We can do it. 
You can do it. I can't do it. No, can't no, do you it. can do it. Buddy, we're right here. Don't do it. Yes, Don't! Follow me. I'll help you through the mines. Okay. Oh, God. Come on, Dogen. We can do this, buddy. Slow and steady. I love Look, Dogen. Rez. I didn't explore it at all. Good hustle out there. Hey. Um, this is for helping me out. Okay, bye. Oh, thank you. Psychic arrowheads. Dang, my bowels move more than you do, Pokey. All right. Feel good to help. I forget, do I need to do something here? I feel like the answer is yes, and I forgot it completely. There it is, I had to raise the flag. Okay. Bye. Bye, Dogen. You're like molasses going uphill in January. Let's Get it. it. No one told me to pack a chute. Did Washington have a chute when he crossed the Delaware? <laughs> yes! Jump, sissy! Is there like a climax to this story? Didn't I mention the gopher yet? Thought I hit that. Okay, let me start over. For Ed. He talks for a while. Fucking kids. Game. We can't do it. Yeah, we're no good, and the coach won't open the gate until someone wins. Yay, Rez! Just punch that to start. You score enough points on this course, kid, and I'll give you a reward. Okay. Punch, punch, punch. Is there any babies in this, or is it all these dudes? There's one. <laughs> oh, they died. Rip. Alright, let's see. Duck. This Most thing. people, they got something to hide. They store away their shame, their dirty little secrets, these tiny vaults in their minds. But the enemy has not allowed any secrets in wartime, are they, soldier? So go ahead, bust open this vault. I got nothing to hide. Ah, good. Leander's Pride. Hmm. You enjoy that. One of my favorites. Feels like that's not something you're trying to hide, but whatever. Pretty sure there's a second one you can find that uh, actually has secrets in it. We'll see if I can find it. The baggage. Mm. Such a happy guy. All right, go this way. Do that. Nope. Ah, 
really? That's how I died? That's fine. Only reason I died was I was trying to get all of them, even though I'm pretty sure I could, um... Just get them all first and then go. But it's fine. I mean, I can just defeat this and then go pick them up as I want. Which is what I'll do. That would save me a trip. I'm anything if not practical. Figment. And this. Anything over here? Nothing that it looks like. Bobby Zilch. What a dick. I hate you so much. I really do genuinely hate that kid. So go up, raise the flag. Go in his mouth. Sounds wrong. Where is it? There we go. You can grab poles like that and swing on them. It's all about upper body strength, you know? Mm. Alright, just to be sure, because I am looking for that emotional baggage, but I don't see it. Not emotional baggage, I'm looking for the other secret bolt. There's an emotional bag. Mm, so happy. Oh shit. That didn't look good. I died so horrible it <laughs> crushed my head. It almost literally crashed Hold my head. right there, boy. That's a mental cobweb. You can collect them with a specialized piece of equipment once you get checked out on it. Till then, just steer clear of them. Yeah, I can do that. I have to come back. That's probably where the baggage is. Not baggage, the vault. We will get this. Get that duck. Get the duck! Oh god. Something. I don't know if you're gonna see that on the recording, but something's screwing up. Come on. Come on. I know what they want me to do. There we go. Oh god. That is apparently not what they wanted me to do there. It worked one time. It didn't work that time. To stand when you're dead. Oh my god, I hate you so much. Almost as much as the fact that I was able to do that with basically no trouble. I was just thinking too much. As you can see, the trapeze is very difficult. Most cadets can't handle it. You might just want to stay away from it. You still get a participation ribbon at the end of camp. Mm -hmm. 
Yeah, see, that's where his actual one is. So you need a cobweb duster. Which I can buy in the shop. Which is not right now. Oh god, there's one! I'm back here. You'll have plenty of time to stand around when you're dead! Yeah, but what if I just stood around and waited for that thing to come back? There it is. Alright. You're like molasses going uphill in January with crutches. Okay, go up here. Is there a way for me to guess there is? But say, I don't think there's a way. But there totally is. Yay! Happy. Reunited, it feels so good. Onward and upward, soldier! That's a little quick. Oh god! Figments I got. 55 out of 79. Hey, I feel like there's. I think I see a silver dollar out there in that room. Why don't you walk out there a bit and pick it up? Got it. Oh no! I totally missed that one. God damn it. Totally missed that one too. It's totally is built so that you can't get them all in one run. Shut up. <laughs> Didn't get them all, but it's fine. Pick them up later. I don't need them now. Ah, the old rolling tunnel of crazy laws, bit. An old one, but a hard one. What you gotta do is. <laughs> ah, who are we kidding? You're never gonna make it through that. <laughs> mm. This one's really trippy as well. So if you don't know, Psychonauts, the way it was developed is that they made an engine that specifically, because the, for the development of it, Tim Schafer constantly said, like, I want this for one specific level. So what they did is that they built basically a dev tool that allowed um, it to be flexible enough so if all of a sudden he said I want them to be able to be playing tic-tac-toe then you can play tic-tac-toe on it so it can actually fit multiple engines and I think that's the same engine they use now and I think was used in Brutal Legend and stuff 
Looks like I can go here, but it's also a door. Yep. I think I can go here and something happens. Hello? Hello? Guess I'm early. Then you go over here. Just what in the Sam Hill do you think you're doing in there? I was just looking for a way out. Oh, sorry about that. Didn't think you'd get to the end so fast. Dang, I didn't think you'd get to the end at all. You surprised me out there, kid. Here, you've earned this. Your first Psychonaut Merit Badge. But I'm always glad to see a soldier come back from the field alive. Now, if you'll excuse me, I gotta go back in. I left some good men back there. <laughs> Way to make us look bad in there. And you are in trouble now. Bobby Zilch ain't happy. You better watch yourself, Goggolicious. What's that, hair boy? You want a piece of me? Hey, Brainiacs, settle down. Why? You worried I'm gonna hurt your boyfriend? No, because Sasha Nine is standing right behind you. Your performance, young cadet, was outstanding. I'd like you to report to my lab for some advanced training. Raz the Spaz is going to be in a special class. Benny, remind me to give him a special beating later, okay? These tests are unauthorized, though, so I can't actually ask you to come. But if you happen to drop in, well, what could I do? Let me just give you this. Remember, your talent will always set you apart, Rasputin. Sometimes isolation is a good thing. It can lead to important discoveries. Wait! I don't even know what your lab is! Is this some kind of test? Sometimes isolation is a good thing. It can lead to important discoveries. And now I'm hearing things. Great. <laughs> You know where this button is from, Coach? Hey! You stole a button from the geodesic psycho-isolation chamber! No, I didn't! I... Bobby Zilch gave it to me! You should have known. That kid spends more time in the cooler than in school. Reminds me of myself when I was his age. Well, go put it back! Yes, sir. Hey, Coach, where is the G? Don't you know how to use your map? Right. Yes, sorry. I actually don't know how to use my map. There it is. Alright, it's somewhere over there. Oh, this is weird. It's it's inverted. Inverted map trolls. That's not great. I'm fixing up the game. And I'll say, yeah, that's Psychonauts. I love this game. It was fun playing it. I hope you enjoyed that. I don't know if it, maybe for the next level I'll play some more, because there's a lot of, like, um, stuff in between that you have to kind of do to get to the next level. If I just want to do the main stages, I think that'd be pretty fun to do. But until next time, everyone, I hope you enjoyed it, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out!